Hello everyone, my name is Cardia with Historical Conspiracies. Today we have a story about these two gentlemen. It's actually a pretty weird mystery. You guys are going to get really, really angry. So get your thinking caps on and let's dive right into it. The case of Terence Williams and Felipe Santo. In Naples, Florida, two men vanished three months apart under eerily similar circumstances. They were last spotted being arrested by Deputy Steve Calkins for driving without a license. Both Terence Williams and Felipe Santos were not arrested or taken to jail for any crime. Both disappeared without a trace. Deputy Calkins stated he dropped both men off at a different Circle K convenience store and he drove away. When it comes to Terence's disappearance, the deputy had Terence's car towed. He called the operator, the tow operator, and he let the tow operator know that the car had been abandoned. What the deputy didn't realize is that there were witnesses that saw him pull Terence over, arrest Terence, and put him in the back of his car. The deputy was not arrested. In recent news, Tyler Perry, a prominent filmmaker and activist, offered a $200,000 reward for information that led to the conviction of this deputy. Approximately 15 years ago, when this case took place, there was action that was taken, although obviously not enough. The deputy was fired, and he was also named as a person of interest, but he refused to appear before a grand jury, so for some reason he was not charged with any crime, and he actually ended up moving to Iowa. There is currently a lawsuit pending, and the lawsuit alleges that Deputy Calkins was on a traffic patrol in January in 2004 when he pulled over Mr. Williams. The deputy never called in the actual traffic stop into dispatch at all, and the deputy drove off with Williams in the back of his uh, vehicle, in the back of the deputy's uh, vehicle. But then later, he returned, the deputy returned alone with Williams' keys and he moved Williams' car. The deputy, uh, Deputy Calkins, did actually call dispatch, but he called dispatch to let them know that there's a traffic hazard and it needs to be removed uh, in reference to that Cadillac, which he had stated as being abandoned. Santos, who had actually disappeared three months earlier to Williams, um, he was in a minor traffic accident in which Calkins arrested him for having no insurance or any other documents. Santos disappeared, never to be seen again. The most recent news that I could find um, as of September 2018, there was a lawsuit filed. As far as I can tell, the $200,000 reward is still available for any information resulting in a criminal conviction. Never too late to speak up. If you know something, say something. I'm going to have information below on the contact numbers that you would need to reach if you have any information pertaining to the disappearance of Williams and uh, Santos. So I would actually love to hear your comments about this entire mystery and what your opinion is about what happened. Be respectful in the comments. We all have a right to our opinions. So please just keep it you know civil in the comments also please like and subscribe hit that little bell icon uh, i'll give you notifications every time we upload we do upload on a regular schedule at least once a week so there's plenty of content for you to uh, listen to besides this story if you really enjoyed it give us a thumbs up and give some other videos a listen thank you again for joining us and give some love to our sponsor bizbin.com uh, bizbin is an auction house and marketplace it is community driven it's a fantastic website guess to go check it out thank you again for everything you guys have a pleasant night